many societies face the prospect of irreparable destruction. COVID-19 is an epidemic disease that is being spread around the world. The lockdown was, in a sense, bad for the young people and good, in a sense, for the, for the elderly because we have them in a safe place, in a sense. Well, some people in the community felt scared, some panicked of having some of their relatives in Tong, elsewhere, to get locked down from them, feel like they will not see them again. The livelihood was taken away from the village. For some people, it drove them to their farms. We engaged in farming, fishing, supplying ourselves with our own food. The, the indigenous people, their Im immune system was strong because the type of food that we eat. We eat the food that we eat. That plays a very important role. We are not accustomed to wearing this sort of mask. And Some people put that for the first time and they have headache. People were getting frustrated. We are not used to it. Amerindians themselves, whenever they are experiencing headache, they drink something that relieves the headache. Or when they are experiencing flu-like symptoms, they take ginger or they take limes and all that boost their immune system. It is important to know our culture. I think we're more healthier than before. We have our own farm where we get our produce, vegetables, so we depend on that. But for other things, then we need money. That was a, a challenge, but... The little produce they get, they have boats going down to sell to come around to Wallo. So that was just for essential needs, and his only essential travel was allowed, so this is how the end come was in Peru. In the Seventh day Adventist, New Star uh, is an acronym for N being nutrition, E being exercise, W being water, S being sunlight, T being temperate in everything, A the good air, R rest, and the other T you um, trust in God.